I'm Christine and I'm a speech language pathologist with Charlotte Speech and Hearing Center. This video will show you how you can use daily routines such as cooking, doing dishes, or washing clothes to work on your child's speech and language skills at home. We'll talk about how you can use narration, a variety of vocabulary, and repetition to help build your child's speech and language skills through daily routines. Here's an example of how we can use a laundry routine to work on language. I'll use narration by talking about the objects I'm using and the actions I'm doing while I'm doing them, just like narrating a movie. Then I'll work on using a variety of vocabulary. I'll be using action words, color vocabulary, and clothing vocabulary. I'll also use repetition to repeat the same vocabulary over and over again to help the child learn the, me the meanings of these new words. Okay, it's time to do laundry. We have to open the door. And now we put all the dirty clothes in. Oh, these clothes are stinky. We can put the gray sock in, put in. We have a white towel, put in. A gray t-shirt, put in. In. Ooh, we have a white t shirt. Put in. Another stinky gray sock. Put in. Now we close the door and we have to open the soap. Open. And then we pour the soap in the washing machine. It gets our clothes all clean. Close the drawer and put the top on the soap. Now we push start and put, it will wash all our clothes. Push. Here's an example of how you can use a cooking routine to work on language. I'll use narration as I talk about the different ingredients I'm using and the actions I'm doing. I'll use a variety of vocabulary to work on action words, um, size, and shape. Then I'll also use repetition to help the child learn this new vocabulary. So first we have to scoop out the flour. We need two scoops. One scoop. One more scoop. Dump. Now we close the baking powder and we mix it all together. Mix, mix, mix. Now we have to flatten out the dough. We can push. Push, 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 push. Okay, now we have to make some circles. Should we use the big cup or the small cup? We can use the small cup. Push, and we push. Circles. Push. Put on. Push. Put on. Okay. Now I'll show you how we can use the routine of washing dishes to work on language. I'll use narration to talk about what I'm using and what I'm doing. 
I'll use a variety of vocabulary to talk about action words and describing words, and I'll continue to use repetition to reinforce the new vocabulary that the child is learning. So here's what that might look like. Okay, it's time to wash our dirty dishes. We have to put the dishes in the sink and we turn the water on. That water feels warm. Now I can squirt the soap in. Squirt, squirt, squirt. And we'll use our scratchy scrub brush. Scrub, scrub, scrub. Scrub, scrub, scrub. Ooh, look at all those bubbles that the soap made. Scrub, scrub, scrub. Scrub, scrub, scrub. We need more water. I can turn the water on. That warm water feels good. Scrub, scrub. Rinse our bowl. And turn the water off. It's all clean. Thanks for watching. We hope that now you have some ideas for how you can use narration, a variety of vocabulary, and repetition to work on language during any routine that you do at home.